Hello YouTube. Here is the DC101 multifunction timer. In this uh, mode, we're in the timer mode. But the DC101 also has a clock time of day mode. And after five minutes of timer inactivity, the clock will always by default reappear. We can access it from the timer screen by pressing all three bottom buttons simultaneously. In this case it displays 854 p.m. If we wanted to adjust the time to any other time, here's, here, is, here it is as simple as it needs to be. To press the M button below and hold it. After about three seconds, the hour digit blinks. In order to run the hour digit up, we press the middle button, the S button. 9, 10, 11. Still reads PM. We continue. Now it's midnight. It's 1 a.m., 2 a.m., 3, 4, 5. Okay, so there it is. We, we just continue to depress the S button until we're happy with, for example, 1 p.m. Depress the M button a, an, an additional time. Now the minutes flash. We can adjust the minutes by pressing the S button again. At this point, we're ready to lock in the 1.04 p.m. time. We depress the M button one more time. There it is. 1.04 is the new time. I could not find any written instructions for setting the time. The original ones that came with the timer were discarded. But in this case, I provided you with uh, a solution in case you needed to adjust the time. Thanks a lot. One more handy feature in the time of day clock function is the uh, option to switch between 12 and 24 hour timekeeping. And in order to toggle between those two modes, we simply depress the S button below. And now we're in 1600 and uh, 1620 hours military time 1620 if we if we depress and release the s button again we toggle back to 12 hour time although there is the uh, the pm indicator uh, which uh, keeps us straight as far as am or pm so again to toggle to press the s we're now in military time where we add four hours to the uh, 12 o'clock noon hour. So four plus 12, 16 hours, or 1621 military time. Again, thanks for watching.